Hey everybody, Damien here from Trade the Fifth. Hope you're all well. Uh, just going to give you guys a quick introduction on our new roller coaster indicator for Trade Station 10. Now, obviously, when you purchase the product from us, you're going to get an email from us with a couple of files in there. In there's going to be your DLL file and obviously the ELD file for the roller coaster itself. First thing you need to do before you actually even open up Trade Station is you need to run the DLL file, okay? So we're using Trace Station 10, so we're going to use Trace Station 10 dot setup here, okay? So you just want to double click on the zip file, and then you see the exe file there. Just double click on that, give it a second. Now you're going to get a message here that says, you know, um, don't run. You need to run this, so click more info, and then click run anyway. Give it a second, and there you've got the installation. This literally takes less than a second. There you go. It's already done. Now all you need to do is just open up Trade Station. Okay, so here we are in Trade Station 10. Uh, this is the, the chart analysis. So the first thing you're going to need to do is you need to get a license key from us, okay? But in order for us to generate one, we need your customer number. So in order to do that, if you go into your page, you go up to help here, you go down to about Trade Station, and then you'll see your customer number here. If you email that to us at info at tradethefifth.com, what we'll do is we'll then respond back with your license key, okay? So, once you've done that, you need, then need to install the ELD file. So, in order to do that, you're going to come up here to File. You're going to go down to Import, Export, Easy Language. And you're going to come down and select the second one down, which is the ELD file. Now, if you click Next, and then we're going to do Browse, okay? So, make sure you've taken a note of exactly where you saved this file. If you go to Browse, and then if we come up into here you'll see the roller coaster file is here just click it and click open and then click next make sure these are in, uh, ticked they are what well, they should be automatically but make sure they are just in case select next again make sure it's ticked and select finish it does a little bit of verification and then it's successfully imported it okay now you need to then add it to the chart itself so in order to do that you're going to right click on your chart Go down to studies and you're going to add study. Now you can see the roller coasters are here now already. So select it, click OK. And now we're going to get an error message, obviously, because what it's doing is it's waiting for a license key. So what we're going to do now is just right click on the chart again, go down to studies, and we're going to edit that study. So here it is, the status is off, so you're going to click status to turn it on and then customize. And then here you go, here's the license key. So you're just going to highlight that, paste in the license key that I would have sent over to you, click default, just to make sure it's then the default input. It means that you don't have to keep putting the license key in every time you run Trace Station. Click yes, click OK, click close, and there you go. It's installed, it's all there ready and waiting. So that's it, it's pretty easy. But if you have any other questions or if you're having any issues doing this, feel free to email me, info at tradethefifth.com. But for now, that's everything. Thanks very much for your time, and I'll speak to you guys later.